July 6th, that is today, marks the 88th birthday of the 14th Dalai Lama, Tenzin Gyatso. Here is an excerpt from my authorised biography which talks about his birth. Thick and dark clouds swirled around Mount Carey, towering over a large valley before dawn came upon Dexter village in northeastern Tibet. The recurring thunder and lightning added to the austere magnetism of the Kyrie, which was worshipped by 400-some people of Dexter as the abode of the protecting deity Kai. It was too early in the day to wake up, but some miles away inside a mud brick house, a woman in her early twenties was awakened by the impending thunderstorm. She lay on her stone bed next to her husband, Chokyang sharing for a while. She gently massaged her pregnant belly and smiled to herself. Something told her a momentous birth was imminent, but she did not quite know what that meant. She had gotten up and begun morning chores when she felt cramps in her stomach. She knew it was time, but continued to work. Babies were nothing new in her life. The one about to be born was her ninth child, and in all, she would have 16 children. Only seven of them would live. She went on to the cow barn to tend to her stock of six zomos, a cross between a yak and a cow, some 80 sheep and goats, several chickens and three horses. On the way, she cleaned the gutter made from branches of juniper wood in preparation for the rains. Women in Dexter or for that matter anywhere in Tibet, did not let their pregnancies interfere with their daily lives. Many of them delivered their babies by themselves. Prenatal care and midwives were unheard of. Allopathic doctors did not exist at all. The month of July 1935 saw intermittent rains and some glorious rainbows. While children of Dexter chased those elusive arches of seven colors, Sonam Somo clutched her stomach once again and massaged it and sat down near a haystack. The Somo stewed their cud and shook their heads while chickens scampered near her as she prepared to deliver the baby. Half an hour later, an eight-pound boy was born. He was named Lamo Thondup, who later became Tenzin Gyatso, whom we now know as the 14th Dalai Lama.